God bless you my brave little soldiers. See, today I am going to introduce a poem and with the help of this poem we are entering into the unit 5 of our English Marigold Book for Children. So this class is the introduction class and I know that you are going to learn a lot and you are going to love this class children. So let's start today's class. Look at this picture children. This is the first picture which I am showing you today. Now the second picture. What do you see in the first picture? Yes, a boy lying down. What is he looking at? He is watching or looking or we can say, say seeing the moon and the stars, right? How is he? Happy, sad, angry or scared? What do you think? Yes, he is scared or we can say he is afraid. What do we do at night, children? We sleep at night. Right? And how is the sky at night? The sky is dark at night. We can see stars and moon in the sky. Now, what do you see in the second picture? A man and the sun, right? How does the man look or feel? Yes, the man is feeling or looking tired. Is the sun shining very brightly? Will it be very hot? Do you feel comfortable when the sun is very hot? See, I asked these three questions together. Yes, the sun is shining brightly. Yes, it is very hot. No, we never feel comfortable when the sun is very hot, right? Now, this is the third picture. And the fourth one. What do you see in third picture? Crowded street. Is it day or night? It is day, not night. Is the street crowded and busy? Yes. And what do you see in the fourth picture? Deserted street. Is the place crowded and busy? This place is deserted, means empty and quiet. What time is it? Exactly, we don't know the exact time, but we can say that it is late night, right? See, most of us are afraid of the dark, aren't we? We fear that some ghost might attack us. We fear that wild animals might be hiding somewhere. It is the fear of unknown that scares us. Fear of unknown. So no need to feel fear. No need to be afraid of the dark. Fine. Are you afraid of the dark? Most of the students, they feel fear and they are afraid of the dark which is not good you should not be afraid of the dark why are you scared you try to find out why you feel afraid and why you are scared what do you do when you are scared if you are scared what should you do and think when you feel afraid what you do so we should not be afraid of the dark children 
so instead of becoming afraid we should enjoy the peace of night and we should sleep early at night children see children we should not be afraid of the dark yes so we can say that don't be afraid of the dark that's what the name of our poem children the name of our poem is don't be afraid of the dark this poem is written by mr ruskin bond he is ruskin bond children mr ruskin bond is an indian author of british descent he lives with his adopted family in masuri india the indian council for child education has recognized his role in the growth of children's literature in india he was born on 19th may 1934 at present his age is 86 years children he got the awards of padma bhushan and padma shri this is the page of your english merry gold book four children the poem don't be afraid of the dark don't be afraid of the dark is a short poem of eight lines you can count the lines children where the poem tells a little child little one not be afraid of the dark so this poem is telling you do not to be afraid of the dark as you can see the name of the poem don't be afraid of the dark This poem is having two stanzas and complete eight lines only. A short poem. This is a short poem, children. The poet says that it is important for the sun to go down after the whole day so that the earth can take rest during the night and everyone can sleep peacefully. See, it is necessary for the sun to go down, children. you have seen the pictures of busy day and the hot sun so it is necessary for the sun to go down so that the earth can take rest at night the earth take rest so we should also enjoy the peace of the night and we should sleep early at night children early to bed and early to rise can make any person healthy wealthy and wise children yes sleep early at night and wake up early in the morning fine so promise me that from today you won't be afraid of the dark and you will enjoy the beauty the peace of night and you will sleep tight yes children So wait for my next video in my next video I will help you with the reading and understanding part of this poem and I will help you to recite this poem with rhythm and action children till then you have to read this poem yourself you will try to read this poem yourself you will take care of yourself and every member of your family and you will stay safe children god bless you all